Mmm, and you can treat yourself good. Mmm, it's really good. Hi, my name is Kwok. I'm 22. Last year I graduated from uni and moved to Paris, and I'm living alone now. In the eight months that I've been living alone, I feel like I've learned a thing or two about romanticizing your own life and just making sure that you're having a good time when you're on your own. It is Saturday today. I have been spending the past few days completely alone in my own head, which has actually been extremely nice. Let's head out to lunch. I can't I have like a pretty loose schedule. At the same time, I feel like there's a lot on my plate. I'm looking forward to just like taking myself out on a date. Alter Mundi is one of my favorite shops. It's like an eco-friendly shop. They sell everything from bags to water bottles to like clothing. Second spot that I want to show you guys just next door, this place called La Mouette Vieux. This place I used to come to study at all the time. It's like super bright and airy inside. They have all of these adorable stationary things. I love stationery. We're at the Musée Carnaval Valley, which is a museum about the history of Paris, but they have this public garden where you can get amazing lunch. Honest, honest. <laughs> I should be the last to know all in this I stand Show me where the ending goes Honest I will take you guys to my favorite Chinese restaurant I should be the last to know Oh my god, look at Paris though Hello Do you like it? Yeah, yeah, I really like it. Yeah. They're very crusty. I guess you always see it. Really? You look so beautiful. <laughs> I push back the serious ceiling. The ends are. Yeah. What is this? What is this? Yeah, because otherwise, if I do it from the inside, they're not going to show me the inside. We actually ended up having a pretty whirlwind afternoon. It rained torrentially. We went to the bookstore, then to dessert, then we ran in the rain from dessert to swing dancing and then had sushi afterwards. I feel super fulfilled. I am exhausted. I finished journaling and talking to Will. See you guys tomorrow. <laughs> super simple lunch cold noodles carrots lamb's lettuce you dip it in the sauce whoop and you eat it mm. honestly i'm out of the house don't know where i'm going
it's afternoon tea time, so we've got some tea, some snacks. I will admit, it is 6.30 already. It's so bright outside still. There's so much enjoyment in making something small so special for yourself. At this period of my life, I'm feeling very, very unsure about myself. I just don't really know what kind of job I'm gonna end up with because I think I'm interested in so many things. I can't see myself being in one specific industry. And I don't really, don't really know what I'm doing with my life at the moment. Also just making myself feel like, like anything that I want is kind of out of my reach. It's a bit of realness to add to the vlog because everyone experiences uncertainties. Sometimes in life you really do just feel, you don't feel like the world is your oyster. I think I'm being a little harsh on myself as well. I think this calls for a rainy day playlist. Chill music to make some dinner to. How dinner turned out. Um, we have a mushroom bean stir fry. Ah, bon appetit, tout le monde. Mm -hmm. You know, in Chinese cooking, sesame oil is the trick. <laughs> Good morning, guys. Today it's Monday. I have made myself some porridge for breakfast. I'm feeling a little under the weather, but I look cute. So I'm gonna go out and take it easy and just have a focused work day, I think. Wow. Tonight, I was looking at my neighbor across the courtyard and her table is facing the window and she had her windows open and I just thought, wow, why haven't I done that yet? So I moved my dining table to right in front of the window and I will not lie, this is the most romantic I've felt with myself in Paris ever. Today I had three meetings in the morning, which was quite a lot. And I actually had an interview this morning, which I hope went well. It's for a job in Taiwan, um, which is like incredible. I'm, I'm really hoping that I get it. And I'm dressed up all cute to go to swing dancing. Wow, look at the sun. is honestly the best thing that I've been doing for myself recently. I've been working, balancing two internships right now, but I'm also starting job hunting. There's just a lot of stuff going on in my head all the time and swing dancing makes me forget everything, completely present in the moment and enjoying living, enjoying other human beings. I mean, thank you, Will, for you know, suggesting that we start swing together. I'm exhausted from just dancing and dancing and dancing. So I'm gonna make myself some lemonade. Thank <laughs> you. 